हेलो गाइस वेलकम टू कोड लाइक ब्रो आई एम योर होस्ट एंड दोस्त चलें एंड इन टुडे ट्यूटोरियल आई एम गोना टीच यू अबाउट शटल मॉड्यूल इन पाइथन ओके सो शटल इज अ स्ट्रांग एंड अ डिफॉल्ट मॉड्यूल इन पाइथन सो दैट्स मीन यू डोंट नीड टू इंस्टॉल इट ओके एंड शटल इज यूज्ड फॉर कंप्रेसिंग फाइल कॉपी फाइल एंड मूव द फाइल एंड सो ऑन थिंग्स So in this video, I'm gonna give you basic idea about Shuttle to use it in your program. Okay. So first of all, we are gonna compress the file by using it. So let's see how we can do this. So import Shuttle module. and then shuttle dot make archive and then and then compress file name which is my file and it is going to be this file and our root directory and i'm going to compress a folder name compress okay so let's save it so here we are okay Now let's create a directory name compress. Okay, that is empty. Let's cut it and paste it. Okay, so I'm gonna compress it. Let's see how we can do this. Being converted, okay, into zip file, right? So we can also extract the file by using it. So for that, write shuttle dot unpack archive, and then file name. In my case, my file dot zip, and I, and then extract it directly where you want your extracted files. So I want these files in a folder name extracted files. Okay, and then and then format is equals to zip, right? So here we have so it's been accepted as you can see. Okay. So this is for compressing file. and this is for extracting file right now we are going to see how we can use it for copying file okay so copying file so for that so now i'm going to copy this file into this okay here copy this into this for that i have to write shuttle dot copy and then source directory i want copy this file and then second argument will be a destination which is which is my compressed folder Save it and run it. So it is copied now.
so now i'm going to copy this file to this okay for that our destination directory is changed so i copy this and paste it and save it and run so here we have an escape sequence error so i use r raw string okay that's it so it's done okay okay now question comes to your mind what is our so it is a raw string let me show you what is raw string and how does it work okay so let me comment it for now i'm going to print a line subscribe backslash and hold like a pro let's see our output so here you see okay so, so it's come to a next line okay but what i want i want to print i want to print backslash and for that i have to add one more backslash to print one backslash right what if i want two backslash i add two more backslash and here is the output two backslash and what if i want to print four backslash now we don't need to add more backslashes to print it on is raw string as said as you can see okay is a another string called f string like a x equals to shellen y equals to 22 and then i'm going to print uh, hello i am this is your it is press okay and then format x comma y so can you guess the output yes okay So x or y value goes there. Okay. If I write f in the starting and then put the value in the braces, so as you can see, same output. Okay. These are f string and r string. Okay. Let's come to our main topic. So this is for copy file. Now I want to move the file. So for that, for moving, for moving. So in this case, let's paste it, and then type your move. and i'm going to do the same thing i'm going to copy this i'm going to move this file to there okay let's see So here you can see our file has been moved. But I don't get why I am getting all the error.
let me move this into a, another directory name move here okay so i add here move here so now i'm going to copy move this file to here okay so it's so it's done okay so our program is working okay so cause of this i'm getting already exist error i have to comment it now we can use our move function okay so that's it guys hope you learn something new you can find the source code link in the description don't forget to like and subscribe thanks for watching